remodel like this then you probably know things change very rapidly one of the things I noticed when I pulled this wall we took the plaster and lath off was that this window casing is junk I'm gonna take it out and redo it all I'm gonna reinforce it with two by fours and put in new sills and trim and everything and because if you can see This sucker is not in there very well. I'm a pretty big guy, and if I were to pull on that even moderately hard, I bet I could rip it right out of the wall. I'm gonna put new two by fours in, get it all framed in, insulated well, put it in there better, and then seal it all up. And then eventually we're gonna get a new window, so this will be just temporary on the window but we've got to have it in there. I want to get this part done so we can drywall. Gosh, I need sunglasses. It's ridiculously warm today. 
Another reason I decided to do this today is because it's two days before Christmas and it's like 50, 55 degrees out right now. It's a beautiful day. And we live in zone five, so that's good. Side and okay, so we don't have a repeat of the mirror. The mirror incident happened when Rob was first taking everything out of the bathroom and the mirror fell and broke. And I don't want that to happen with the window. So I'm gonna go upstairs. These hex head screws are so much better than these old Phillips head screws. I'm using these because I still have a bunch of them and I want to use them up for stuff like this. These are awful. They always slip. They always come out of the thing with the hex head screws. I mean, they stay in there tight and it's so much better. Just like that right there. You don't do that with hex head screws. It doesn't slip off. And it just broke off. Piece of crap. 
I'm done. I think it's time for a new hole saw. This is purely to fill this hole. I'm gonna caulk that in. We're gonna put shiplap on the ceilings upstairs. Um, that's what Kristen wants. That's what she's gonna get. So fill the hole. I'm just gonna caulk it in. Then we're gonna cover over it. I don't really care. So that's that. All right, I got some acetone. I tried mineral spirits to clean off this frame, this vinyl. Get all this uh, glue and stuff off of it. Doesn't work. So I got some acetone, I'm gonna clean it all up. And then we're gonna put it in. So last night when I put this trim up, it was too dark to film, so I'm showing you what I did today. So we put this trim up last night, and we are going to paint the window. So it's just a trial paint. Um, we're going to spray paint it, no big deal. Eventually we're going to be getting rid of these windows anyway, so we just want to see how it looks and I don't think it's going to hurt anything and worst case I got to come up here with some acetone or mineral spirits and wipe it off it's no big deal it's on the south side of the house no one's really going to see it but us we just want to see how it looks um, and I can kind of picture it in my mind but I want to see it on the house so Here's what the old windows look like from outside. It's just aluminum wrap on the, or kind of the trim. But the wood underneath is rotten. I mean, it's absolutely gone. This is PVC um, trim boards, which are not cheap, but they will supposedly last Indefinitely, forever. Thank you, Josh.
stuff right here. This is serious coffee. You get one shot with this though. It says for professional use only, you need to be able to have some sort of idea how to caulk before you go using this stuff. It is no joke. If you're not a professional, you just play with it. Alright, so here's the finished window. It's got some moisture because that gas in the middle is gone. That part's kind of junk, but ultimately we're gonna replace these windows. That white you see is the inner part of the other window or the inside window that I can't get to to paint, so no big deal. But there's the window painted black. This will be the look um, in the future when we get actually get black windows, but this is what we got for now, so I think it turned out real good. I'm pretty happy with it. What do you think? Thumbs up. I like the black. I think that's the way to go. I, mean, I like it. Yeah. Well, from the roof of the farmhouse. Thanks for watching. See you on the next video. Welcome back to Four Acres in a Farm. Oh, no.